shit crispy. It tastes like when your foot falls asleep. <laughs> What is up, all my baddies? It's your girl Chanel B, aka Chanel Badass, back again with another one. So, if you've never seen me before ever in your life, I'm a licensed cosmetologist and 19 year old entrepreneur. If you do know who I am, shout out to you. You're the best for coming back. All my newbies, do me a favor hit the subscribe button, leave me a comment, give me a big thumbs up if you think I'm cute or whatever. And let's get into the purpose of this video, right? I know why you're here. I know. I know what you want we y'all all seen the title and y'all clicked on that video and y'all went crazy why because y'all want to know yeah you you watching this right now you want to know how the I keep my lace wigs I'm sorry my chair's squeaking but y'all want to know how I keep my wigs on for two weeks three weeks a month well actually a month is pushing it I have clients who keep their wigs on for a month I can't keep one hairstyle that long. I like to switch it up, but you know. I don't have time to be doing my hair every other day, taking my wig off every night, gluing it back on in the morning. No, that's not what we're doing. So if you're wondering, how does she sleep in it? How does she take a shower with it? How can she wash her face? Well, boo-boo, baby, I'm about to show you right now. So this is my nighttime routine to keep my hair laid and when I wake up it looks just like this it looks exactly like this in the morning nothing changes so first I'm gonna tell y'all the real tea hold on I'm gonna tell y'all what y'all been doing wrong now I know this is a staple piece from my wig wearers and my edge slayers okay the the silk scarf the satin scarf I know we all have one we all need one okay but not for bedtime i know every single one of y'all that's wearing this i know it falls off in the middle of the night and you want to know what else i know i know you don't wake up and put it back on i know you don't same thing with the bonnets if you got a satin bonnet bonnets are great especially for your natural hair because you don't want your hair rubbing against your cotton pillowcase or your pillow or whatever it be it but baby for your wigs your sew-ins you know your your protective styles this ain't the one especially if you want your edges laid this ain't the one why because you're gonna wake up and it's gonna be on the floor and you know where your edges is gonna be here 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 and here all over the place so I know you're wondering well Chanel if you don't wear a scarf if you don't wear a bonnet what the hell do you put on your head how do you keep your hair looking so amazing how do you keep it straight how do you keep your edges laid Scarfs, your satin bonnets Save those for another time. This ain't that kind of party. This ain't that event, okay? What you need to get is a dewy, a silky, a do-rag. Yes, a men's do-rag, okay? You want to know why? Because look at this. Look at the construction of this right here, okay? And you know you want to flip it inside out because you can't have the line making dents in your hair. But the construction of this is perfect. And this is, I think this is water or like a grease stain or something. I don't know. But... The construction of this is cut perfectly to go right over your ears. The same way we cut our lace to go over our ears, this is this is perfect. It has the strings so you could tie it as loose or as tight as you want. And it's not going to go anywhere. It's going to stay on your head all night. How do you think men keep their waves? Do, do they silkies come off in the middle of the night? Absolutely not. Get you a dewy. Get you a do-rag. Okay. These bad boys, you can find them for cheap, like $3.99, and this is what you do, okay? This, this is my nighttime routine. So I got my paddle brush, right? Always brush your hair out before you go to bed, like, just, just for the reason that. And you see this lovely Chanel B hair collection, okay? She's sitting pretty. She's doing well. And this is still the same wig that I've been showing y'all on my Instagram, at Chanel B Hair Co. It's just been, um, you know, taken out, washed, and reinstalled. But she's doing lovely. I don't use anything on it except dun, da, 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 the Holy Grail. Now, let me tell you a little secret about this bio silk right here. And I'm sorry, you can't see it because the glare. But let me tell you something about bio silk silk therapy, okay? This is better than any serum, any argan oil, anything. Use this right here on your real hair, use it in your weaves, use it in your wigs. It's amazing. Um, I'm not sure if it's meant to be 
a heat protectant but I do use it before I flat iron my hair and it straightens amazing it gives it just enough shine but not too oily um, you only need a little, like, nickel size amount. When you get this stuff right here, go to TJ Maxx. Do not order this on Amazon because let me tell you what they did. They charged me the same price. You see this right here? This $19.99, I paid that through Amazon, and guess what I got? I wish I still had it to show y'all, but it ran out so quick because it was the little, like, 8-ounce bottle or something like that. Not even. It was like a 4-ounce bottle. This is a 12 ounce fluid ounce bottle right here for $20 from TJ Maxx. Now, if you get this um, outside of TJ Maxx, it's probably going to cost you a lot more for a bottle this size. Now, my hair is pretty moisturized, and I don't want to make it too greasy because I did put some in this morning. Um, so, I'm not going to put product in my hair, but brush your hair out, apply this product, and then I like to brush my hair kind of in a backwards direction because I like my hair to have that little lift like I use a hot comb and everything to get my hair to go back because I don't like it like it's kind of in my face right now because it's been a long day got rained on but I don't really like my hair to be in my face throughout the day so to get it to lay how I want to of course I have to set it at night so I'm combing this back so we got it all going back and I'm just gonna put on my do-rag Again, inside out with well with the seam facing outward so that it's not making creases in your hair. And I have like 25 of these things. No, I'm kidding. I have like 10 of them. And instead of tying it, you know, just around the outside like you would on a day when you're trying to be cute <laughs> when it matches your outfit, I'm going to tuck it under my hair. I'm going to pull her nice and tight. And I just tied in the bow in the front. You could loop it back around to the back. You could do whatever you like to do. But I'm just going to tie her in a bow in the front. So I just take it and I tuck the ends in. Up the silk in the back covering your hair. Now, I don't like to let my ends hang. So I do take it and I just tuck it into a satin bonnet. But this stays on all night. And I look so ugly, but... <laughs> It stays on all night. It's not going to go anywhere. And when I wake up, my hair is going to look amazing. So just for the sake of me, you know, being a woman of my word, I'm going to wake up tomorrow morning with y'all. And I'm going to take this thing off and I'm going to show y'all what my hair looks like. So I will see y'all in the morning. Good night. <laughs> Ain't this what they've been waiting for? You ready? Say so not. But I am back. It's the next day. Y'all saw me wake up this morning looking a mess. I went and got dressed. I just have on a fashion over bodysuit. But um, I still didn't do my makeup, so I look a little rough. But we're going to take my hair down together as promised. Okay. Now, I'm going to say, like, you see this right here? This is my frontal. My frontal is body wave and my um my hair is straight. So if my hair is wavy in the front, that's just what it does every fucking time I go to sleep. So I'll just flat iron it. But that's not the point. The point is <laughs> wig still intact, edges to the back. You know what I'm saying? But everything is still intact. I got a line in my forehead. But my edges is there. Everything is still there. Wig still on. I did take a shower. I did wash my face this morning. So, you know what I'm saying? It ain't nothing to pass the flat iron over this really quickly. By the way, just a FYI, I don't like use gel or anything on my edges. I just kind of mousse them so that they could keep their shape and then I comb the mousse out. So like, um, that's why they're not stuck down. I don't like my edges to be crispy or nothing.
my hair doing like dumb stuff because I never style it like I wear frontals for the versatility and then I don't style my hair with it a cape around even when you think they ain't around they around